Good evening. A local man is now facing a murder charge in the death of his wife. News Channel 15 first broke the news of Scott Patterson's indictment earlier today on Wayne.com. The grand jury indictment follows four days of hearing evidence against Patterson in the death of his wife, Lisa, back in July. News Channel 15's Megan Stemble was in Wabash when Scott Patterson spoke publicly for the first time. News Channel 15 captured this video of Scott Pattison handcuffed in a police squad car. Anything to say, Scott? I'm not guilty. Wabash County Sheriff's deputies booked Pattison into the county jail shortly after 3 Monday afternoon. They arrested him without incident at his mother's Grant County home after a grand jury handed down an indictment of murder against him. It comes almost three months after the death of his wife, Lisa. It happened on July 2nd at the couple's LaFontaine home. Scott Pattison told police he'd come home to find Lisa's body, lifeless, a barbell across her throat. Her death would later be ruled a homicide, clearly defining it was no accident. In the waning hours of the grand jury proceedings, News Channel 15's camera rolled on this scene. Wabash County Sheriff's deputies loading unassembled exercise equipment from the judicial building into this truck and hauling it away. Wabash County Prosecutor Bill Hartley said details about the evidence the grand jury reviewed wouldn't be available until a public trial. We're at the very beginning of this, it will probably be a long process, um, and it will take on similar characteristics as any other criminal case. Scott Pattison is due in court on Tuesday at 1 o'clock to formally hear the murder charge against him. Reporting from Wabash, I'm Megan Stemble. Not guilty. News Channel 15. A 